How to take apart a Glock slide. This is the slide from my Glock 17 Gen 5, although this procedure will work for virtually any Glock. The first thing we want to do is remove the slide cover plate, which is this piece in the back here. Now this cover plate is under spring tension from the firing pin spring, so we need to remove that spring tension to get this off. So just take a small pin punch. This is a 3 30 seconds pin punch. And you want to go right in this slot here and we want to press down on the spring and at the same time we do that we can slide this up with your thumb so while you press so press down on the spring and then this should slide right up and out keep your thumb here and gently release the spring because these things are under spring pressure again you don't want anything to go launching and now you can push the firing pin assembly right out of the gun like that and then you can grab the plunger and pull that out okay next we want to remove the extractor right here so all you need to do put your hand under it and press on the firing pin safety plunger and the extractor will drop right out and then when you turn the slide upside down the firing pin safety plunger will fall out and the spring uh, that goes on that will also possibly fall out. Now this plunger may look a little different on some of the older generations of the Glock but it performs the same function. Now if you want to go one step further and take all these pieces apart we can do that. So this is the extractor and the spring just pulls right on out of that. This is the extractor depressor plunger and the extractor depressor plunger spring and this black piece here is called the spring loaded bearing. All right so these pieces just pull apart. This piece will pull out of here. I would advise against pulling this out unless it's really dirty. It's very hard to get a hold on that. So be very careful about pulling that out. So all right now we have basically the firing pin assembly here. This is the firing pin, firing pin spring. This is actually called the spacer sleeve. And this black piece here, this is actually two pieces. They're called spring cups. This is what actually keeps the spring from coming off the firing pin. All right, so place this on the table. You want to get a good grip on the spring, but not on the black piece here. So I'm just going to use a, uh, a cloth rag here just to keep my fingers from getting pinched in that spring. All right, and then I'm just going to squeeze it right underneath of the black ring pull it down now these these are actually two pieces this is a spring cup so it comes apart like that in two halves comes apart in two halves and then gently release the spring because it's going to come all the way up if you let go of that too soon it's going to launch across the room that comes off the firing pin then the sleeve comes off all right and there's all your pieces this is as far apart as your slide uh, really comes apart. I could take this optic cover off, but that's not really necessary. There's nothing under there. And the front sight I haven't taken off. There's a special tool for that. 